congratulations. Thank you so much. Three Brits and you're performing. Yeah. I mean, tell me how you're feeling right now. <laughs> I'm over the moon. I'm so happy. It's a really, it's a good day, good night. I'm looking forward to everything. So it's fun and it's nice to be home. It's nice to be home to celebrate all that. I just got to pull these up. My dress is so heavy. <laughs> it looks beautiful. It's like lots of uh, sequins. So you both look me. absolutely amazing. Sorry, I did a little walk around and I asked the fans, who are you here to see? Everybody either said John Cena or Dua Lipa. How does that feel? Oh, oh that's so sweet. Well, we're so happy to be here and promoting something that we really love and we're excited about. Yeah, John? Definitely the same. It's always good when your work can affect people and they can get excited and hopefully they enjoy Argyle. And listen, this is a crazy, incredible, fun film. When that trailer dropped, everybody was just like, ah, what's coming? <laughs> and what was your experience? I mean, you're now fully in the little acting world, having your little cameos. How are you finding it, Dua? Yeah, I love it. I absolutely love it. It was so much fun. This is a really special experience. And um, I loved working with John and working with Henry. And I just felt very well looked after, you know? It was my first experience doing anything like this. And I felt very supported. and. I'm just excited for everyone to see, to see it, to see what they think. <laughs> I think they're not ready for it. I think we needed a film like this that's silly, fun, but also people are obsessed with spies and thrillers and fun. Did you enjoy it? Was it straight away? Yes, yes, yes. A hundred percent. I actually chased Matthew Vaughn down and said, listen, I know you're making a movie. I want to be in it. And uh, to his credit, he said, I can give you a part that might develop. I said, stop right there. I don't care what the future is. I'm worried about the now. And if you're making Argyle and I can be part of it, I'll be in it in any capacity. So I literally chased him down for this job. You've been, doing, you've been all over the world. I feel like you've been doing all the award ceremonies with the Barbie crew. Yeah. Is it a bit surreal being on the other side? Like you were in this, I mean, John did wrestling and now you're an actor, a fully fledged actor. When you venture into this world, does it feel different? Yeah, it feels different. It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a completely new experience, but I think it's all about, you know, surrendering to the experience and just seeing what, 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 what comes of it. So it's been so fun. I love it. And John, do you ever get used to these premieres? Like the fans, they're crazy. They adore you. Uh, this, is, this is all magic. You are selling yourself tremendously short. <laughs> As an incredible live entertainer and a creative musician, you have everything it takes to do anything in this realm. Oh, you're, you're my God. Spe that's speaking so from somebody that's been in the lens with you, you're absolutely fine. And, Whatever the hell you want to accomplish with your life, you're going to do it. So. Oh, gosh, John. I'm going to cry. My final yeah. question is this. You have, your <laughs> own, you, you, you have your own platform, which is amazing. And you advocate. You speak up. I don't know if you've been on it, John, but um, you speak up for women. You recommend books. You talk about things that we need to talk about. Yeah, I mean, it's really a, a, a passion project of mine, Service 95, that I've been working on. It's... I had like a blog when I was much younger where I would do things at a very different scale and now that I get to do things in this capacity and get to commission stories from journalists all over the world and get to recommend books and have conversations with authors and do a podcast and all those things like it's all very um, exciting and I feel like it's just fun to get to share that with people and, and create a community in that sense like that is really what it's all about listen go have fun lovely yes, to talk to you both you so and remember what he said you can do anything you want if John uh, Cena says it <laughs> I, I believe it.